Hi guys, okay, I was just doing a reel real quick and I was telling Matt that I can't stop squishing these Jane bags. I'm sorry, this is somebody's Jane bag. It's like you're, it's like a, really you know, upset. line us with a comfort blanket. It's yes, your comfort that's bag. that's what it feels like. It's so squishy and like, I love it. And yes, the silver ones are coming back in. We're getting little tiny batches of them. I just want to show you how amazing this bag is. So first of all, it is just this beautiful, beautiful leather that we're using. Why are we oh, outside? We're outside because there's someone, a couple of people in the store and I didn't want to make them uncomfortable by speaking really loud. So like, nervous. Yeah, so sorry. Thank I was you. like, let's go outside so they can have a nice shopping experience. Okay, so, okay, I just want to show you this bag because some people are like, well, this is a very simple bag. It is, but it's not. Because when you're working with leather, it's very hard to find a perfect piece of leather that is this big. Right? Yeah. And this is a huge, huge piece of leather. So we're working with really nice leathers. So it just takes forever to just do these perfect And that's cuts. the trade-off with the so natural hides because right. the animal might scratch itself. Or... And there might be little holes from a fence that they scratch themselves against. Um, there are stretch marks. So I think that's the, the, you know, and so it takes a lot of skill to cut and to make sure each of these are cut perfectly. So that's why these batches are small. And I'm really, really thank you and guys for thank you for being patient. The silver one is almost done because I know there's a bunch of pre-orders against these, and the black is almost done. The luggage is running really low, so if you guys are interested, we are cutting another batch, but I would definitely grab the last couple of these. But I am just obsessed with this bag, and then I've got the little medium one here and all of the yellow. Do you want me to hold something? Yeah, they're okay. so cool. Like I just love them. They're so soft and. When, if you have one, just give us feedback because my feedback about this is I've been obsessively carrying mine for a very long time. I find that it starts to mold, and I say this with all the bags, but again, it's the same thing. It molds to my body, and somehow the one weird, brilliant thing about this bag is due to the size, you're thinking, well, I should be carrying stuff in here. But honestly, sometimes I just have my phone and my glasses in there. But I'm like, I love this bag so much, I'm gonna just take it with me. Like today, unnecessary to bring my bag because I was just running in here to you do just something like on my computer. It. And so I was like, well, should I just bring my keys and my phone? And I'm like, no, I have to bring my bag with me because I love carrying it. So I just want you guys to know how wonderful this bag is. And it's just the simplicity of it. It looks like it's simple, but it's just the way it has been structured and the way it's been made and a lot of thought has been put into it. It really is a beautiful, beautiful bag, and I just love it. So I hope you guys love it, and I really, um, it's gonna come in more fall colors, but right now, these three colors are amazing. We have black also, and um, whoa, there's wasps everywhere. Okay, I'm gonna have to leave, because last time I got bit by a wasp, my hand swelled up for like days. Ah! <laughs> oh my God, my God, they're everywhere.